Well, I enjoy my shopping, but today has been absolutely chaotic. As soon as they opened the doors here at nine o'clock, people were literally stampeding through the door. We saw people running up the escalators, clearly knowing exactly what bargains they wanted to, uh, to get. Others, however, were brave enough just to come out and do a bit of browsing. They had, though, hundreds of people been queuing right around the block in the dark, uh, in the cold weather, but they didn't mind because I spoke to one man who was from China and said that Boxing Day in London is the place to be. It's the place to go to the sales. Um, now, here it is still incredibly busy. Hopefully we can show you now. Um, I'm told that apparently handbags are some of the big sellers, but also men's clothing as well. So it's not just the women who are out uh, trying to do their shopping. And there are loads of different statistics that are out today. But one company says that around 10 million people are expected to hit the high street uh, over today, which is in a way astonishing when we're constantly talking at the moment about it being tough economic times. However, people that I spoke to earlier clearly weren't struggling to find a few pennies and really wanted to come out and find a few bargains. I'm just getting started, but I'm going to go to the shoe department and I'm not done with the handbags yet. So It's my first time to experience passing day. I feel so cool. You enjoy it? Yeah, I'm very enjoy it. So Thank what you, you. What are you queuing for now? Mew Mew. Do you mind if I ask you what you've managed to snap up? Um, just perfume, but that's it. And that's is that what you wanted? Is that what no, you're No, I wanted out? bags, but it's just too busy. So I'm going to go home. Here in London, of course, the tourists always help to uh, boost the takings a little bit, but other retailers have really been struggling in the run-up to Christmas. Of course, we saw some pre-Christmas sales already, and also people heading to the internet as well. That's clearly taking people away from the trade that people would n normally get on the high street. But here in the West End of London, I'm told that around 800,000 people are expected to hit the shops today. In Selfridges alone, they have made one and a half million pounds in the first hour of opening. Across the West End, they're expecting to make around 50 million pounds. So it's clear that the money is out there and the shops will be hoping that that prosperous end to the year will continue into 2013.